We're snorkeling today, YouTube. Conditions aren't great, but we're gonna get out there and see what happens. YouTube. You're watching Swamp Fox Adventures. I'm Wally. We got all the doggy dogs up here. Well, not all of them, but a lot of them. And from standing here on the porch, it sounds like it's a good day to go snorkeling. I'm not hearing the waves. There's no big wind. Um, so Real Babes and I, we've been trying to go snorkeling. She's about to leave town. She has to fly back to South Carolina to address some things with the businesses. And we've been trying to get a good break in the weather so she can do some snorkeling before she goes back. We also have uh, a bunch of people scheduled to come over today. So we're gonna follow up on that stuff. And if we can go snorkeling, we're definitely gonna try. Okay, y'all, we have some people rescheduled. So we're gonna go snorkeling, hopefully. Um, like I said, there's no wind, there's not hearing the waves crashing. So we think it's gonna be a good day, but we won't know until we get out there. And we'll be there to check conditions in the next five minutes. Okay, I got our gear. Here's the green machine. Well, it doesn't look great, but it doesn't look bad. We're gonna go check out Cueva. We might be able to pull off Cueva today. We're gonna find out in just a few minutes. It's not terrible. We might do a little snorkeling. What are you thinking? You want to try? You can try. We're going to walk up and take a look. Um, we're on the fence about snorkeling. We might. We might not. Conditions aren't great, but it's doable. We're going to try to get an idea of what the visibility is. Doesn't look bad. It's not great. Okay, we're back at the green machine to grab some gear, and then we're gonna go see what it's like out there today. You ready, baby? Okay, here's base camp for today. There's somebody in a ponga fishing to the right of that rock out there and we're in a little bit of a holding pattern for now real babes forgot her snorkel gear so she just went to get that and uh i think we'll we will snorkel once she has the gear to snorkel okay this is where we're gonna make our approach i'm gonna go ahead and get my fins on What do you think of the current? Huh? What do you think of the current? This place 
treacherous. <laughs> it is a little treacherous today. Uh, getting out here was no joke. Now that we're out here, it's not bad, but that current is like... Woo. Yeah. Where we're at right now, it should be a little lighter. Yeah, no, it definitely is. We're getting out here. Woo. Yeah, that a lot of duck diving. And I'm, I here comes like a little one behind you. Yeah, I feel like I'm a strong swimmer, you know? Yeah. Coming back in and this dog keeps swimming out trying to meet us. Hi, <laughs> hey, how are you? Dog was so excited he grabbed one of Real Babe's fins. <laughs> So how was it? Treacherous going out, heavy current while we were out there, treacherous coming in, but it was gorgeous. Yeah, it was a pretty good day. I... It did turn out to be a pretty good day. I like this guy. Yeah, I thought he was going to take off with one of your fans. <laughs> he almost did. I was like, oh, how sweet he's helping me. No, he ripped that sucker off my foot and took off with it. Yeah. <laughs> I think our little Fido buddy's upset that there's nobody else surfing or snorkeling. We're the last ones coming out of the water. He might be looking for someone. Sato in a trash can. Did you see it? We decided to grab some lunch and caffeine at Simple. Just a little, did a little rinsey rinse of the feedy. So did Real Babes. Let's grab some grub and go get some work done. Real Babes is doing some coconut water. I'm doing some regular water and of course, some coffee. You did. Pasta Alfredo chicken with all the vegetables. I did a shrimp pasta with all the vegetables. Oh my goodness, that looks so good. Are you all full? I am, that was really good. You ready to do some work? Yep. Okay, we're gonna head home and get some work done. Oh, now we get to go work. Ow.
unfun. Hi, Thunder. Hi, little buddy. Hi, little buddy. Hey, Kaza. How are you? You're a good girl. Where's Chaco? I see Chaco. How's the Montero taste? Why are you licking it? You're a good boy. Oh, yeah, you can smell that other doggy on me. Yeah, you Montero licker, you. Hi, Chaco. Not sure what else we're going to get into today. First thing we're going to do is go ahead and rinse off all of our snorkel gear. And I've got to take some bar soap up and down my zipper because it's getting salt deposits and the, the zipper's starting to jam. Okay, I got all my gear rinsed. And I am going to take a quick break. And then I'm going to water all the bananas. We got to water all the trees bananas passion fruit everything we haven't been getting any rain and i've missed like two days of water hi mr wiggles you look like you're excited for some air conditioning i might take a little nap like all the doggies are doing but i still got sand all over me the sand we have here on the north coast sticks like glue and it's a pain in the butt to get off so i'm gonna go rinse my feeties off again so i don't track sand into the bed you look bummed out mr wiggles did you think we were doing something more exciting than spraying my feet off oh my goodness mr wiggles is freaking out it's raining but carlos is here mr wiggles is usually scared to go outside in the rain Bueno, sometimes the sea, sometimes it's... Pero me posible es una diferente tipo o no? Mucho lleve hoy. Río, bueno. Sí. Well, Carlos just took off his son and Piero and it's raining like a lot which yeah is kind of a blessing it's been pretty dry well we don't have to water bananas now i know that's we exactly don't have to water was everything was everything's getting watered right now yeah i'm really stoked and carlos brought us three new papaya trees that i'm going to put in the ground in just a minute here we had one it was getting pretty big but the horse probably the dogs um snapped it it was about that big around but they're pretty fragile they're real tall and snippy like they can break easy and somebody broke it i'm blaming the dogs i'm gonna blame the little brown dog <coughs> chaka yeah she wasn't even here when it broke <laughs> why why do you hate chaka so i don't much? hate chaka i just hate having five dogs where is chaka i don't know here comes kaza she's like i love being an outside dog till it rains <laughs> She's like, I want back in. Kaza, you know how to get back in. Come on in. You're soaked. You look like a, you look like a drenched rat. <laughs> Come on. Kaza. She's like, let me in. <laughs> you know how to get in. Kaza can get in the gate at pretty much any point she wants. But she was being such a wimp. What's the matter, Kaza? You're all wet. All the dogs are excited to see you. Luna, you don't like the rain. Well, it's raining, so I'm doing laundry. Um, as soon as I get a break in the rain, I'm gonna go plant those three papaya trees. And I'm cleaning coolers, cleaning cars, all kinds of boring stuff. The thunder doesn't mind the rain at all. And to be honest, Kaza, hi Kaza, she doesn't really mind the rain at all. But whenever she can get sympathy, like, oh, I'm a wet dog, she totally milks it. Don't you? You're a smart dog. You also do pretty much whatever you want. Chaco's a good girl. You're a good girl too, Kaza. Don't you worry. Okay. 
Check this out, y'all. We are pizzaed out, like completely. That's how much pizza's left. We ate on that pizza for like two to three days. How many days did we eat on that pizza? Three. Three. The thing was ginormous um, from Serrano's. I, I'm still impressed with how big it is. So I'm gonna feed a lot of this to the dogs right now. Oh, it is still raining. Hi, Chaco, would you like some pizza? Yeah, you would. Suddenly, Chaco got very, very serious. You know what pizza is. Luna even came out for a little pizza, pizza at the end, but now she wants back in, I think. Pizza says, or Luna says no pizza. I'm not gonna deal with the rain. Wiggles, you want in? I don't see the rain letting up, so I'm gonna go ahead and plant those papaya. Okay, we got the papaya, the soil and a shovel and unfortunately the rain okay i got the three holes dug and now i'm gonna plant okay i got some garden or landscaping wire it's like a little twist tie three stakes so i'm gonna stake these guys up and then i'm gonna water them even though it's raining i want to make sure i really 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 soak the potting soil i put at the base okay we got one two and three in the ground and I didn't space them very part, maybe four feet on that one, maybe three on this one. Rain even filled the dog pool up for us. It's still raining, not as much as it was. I'm gonna go prune up the bananas because it's gonna be an early, early night for us, I think. Moving right along. All our bromeliads, the whole avocado tree. The Dama de Noche, which is Lady of the Night. We've got these orchids that Real Babes put up. Those bromeliads, which we picked off the side of the road. They had blown out of the tree. The pineapple, bird of paradise, unidentified lily, <laughs> more pineapple. The most recent pineapple, too shaded. The birds of paradise really took off. So I'm gonna plant some more pineapple over here. Here's the Dame de Nocha on the other side, which is also doing good. Oh, there's another orchid that I guess Real Babes put up. And you can see where once we trim up the leaves, we just drop them at the base and that serves as sort of a mulch as they break down. It shades the soil and it keeps the soil more moist. And some of the plantains are starting to get some size on them. This one's probably 10 foot. And Y'all can see here, we're starting to get the first fruits. Those were blooms not too long ago. And that's parcha, passion fruit. So it's one of our favorites. We're gonna be getting a lot here soon. I was able to catch one of the blooms. Look at how pretty that is. Real Babes absolutely loves them. And there, that's gonna be loaded. Oh, there's another bloom. And yet another one. Love parcha. Looks like the rain might have let up for the rest of the night, which would be cool. But I'm gonna call it a wrap on this video. We're not gonna do anything else tonight. Maybe cook, eat a little, watch some TV, go to bed. Love y'all, tomorrow's Tuesday and I think I'm taking Chaco to the vet. Not sure, but we will see y'all tomorrow. Love y'all, good night.